still don't know who did it. Fox 25 Sarah Smith spoke with the victim's son and daughter in law. She's live outside OSBI with their plea tonight. Sarah. Dana Wendy OSBI identified the victims six months ago. Now the family hopes this investigation has not hit a dead end. Devin Ratliff says he hasn't spoken to his parents, Bobby and Faye Ratliff, since February 2020. The last conversation, I talked to my father at 7 o'clock that evening, probably talked for 15 minutes. Then he said, hey, someone's at the door, got to go. And then that was the last time I talked to my father. That's when investigators say they found two bodies shot and burned in a house fire in Red Rock. In March of this year, they were identified as Bobby and Faye Ratliff. I think someone approached the door. You know, it was either someone they knew or someone they didn't. Devin says they have given OSBI their theories on the murder. Investigators say none of the tips have worked out. I've got a small theory. I mean, I'm, which I know that a lot of people in the community do as well. They have a thought in their mind that, you know, but no one's, until something goes to trial and then someone gets convicted, you can't really point fingers at this point. Friends say Bobby and Faye Ratliff didn't know a stranger or have an enemy. Just really glad we finally get to have a celebration of life and remember my parents and actually have a happy moment since the tragedy that did happen. And I'm really looking forward to that. And I know that a lot of the community up there is too as well. And that celebration of life is this Saturday at 2 in Perry. We have more details on our website, okcfox.com. Live in Oklahoma City, Sarah Smith, Fox 25 News. All right, Sarah, thank you. A motorcyclist is dead tonight after crashing.